Hey Lee Constance, new founder of Personal Training Elite here and welcome back to part two of the Organic Marketing Masterclass. And in this episode, we're gonna be talking about power positioning and proactive prospecting. So in the last episode, if you haven't watched it, I spoke about Facebook groups and how to go in and find more leads and more clients for free using organic marketing. And so in this episode, it's now time to talk about what happens next. So how do we take people from these groups after you've added value for them and their lives and turn them from just being a stranger into a potential client? And so what you're gonna learn today is how to actually convert complete strangers from social media into a potential client. So I'm teaching you this stuff for free because I really wanna build more trust with trainers like you and show you how to get your next client for free. So if in the future you think about growing your business further and you want to automate and attract more clients using the strategies that we teach here and the more advanced stuff that we teach inside the academy, you'll think of us and maybe consider applying for the Personal Trainers Elite Academy. So with that being said, let's dive in to today's training. So when it comes to power positioning, the one thing you always want to lead with, as we said in the last episode, is value. <laughs> okay, value. We always want to lead with value. But what does that actually mean? So it means using a combination of written posts and videos, and for bonus points, especially with Facebook right now, doing live videos. Right, Live videos are so powerful for connecting with people because one, Facebook really like them, and so they give you more organic visibility, and two, they are more authentic, meaning you're not trying to polish yourself up too much, have perfect lighting, they're just you, and they show your flaws, which makes you relatable to people. And I'm gonna explain why in just a second. So these posts, they wanna be leadership-led. So what that means is you're writing things to position you as an expert in your field of health and fitness. And so these are things that you already know. You would have studied this as you became a trainer on your certification courses. You would learn these things through your own um, experiences, working out in the gym, working with clients. And so you're just really putting together posts that help those people that are now becoming your friends through these Facebook group interactions. As I mentioned in the first episode of this series, you are already getting people to come to your profile and for them to see what you're about. And so this is where you want that content to be ready for them. So leadership posts, writing about your experiences. Maybe you've overcome some challenges in your fitness journey. Maybe you've helped a client overcome a big challenge in theirs, right? So you're sharing posts and tips as well that could help these potential people that are now coming to your profile. And you wanna make sure that you mix in some vulnerable posts. And this is probably gonna be one of the hardest things that you'll ever do on social media, but it was the one thing that got me the most clients and grew my business bigger than ever before. It was when I started being more open and transparent about the struggles that I had. You see, most personal trainers are posting how easy it is and how great they look, but it doesn't make people feel good about themselves, right? The regular person who's struggling with their fitness and their health and has been for years, they don't want to see another person who's on their high horse just living life and making out like it's easy. So when you connect with them by getting vulnerable, and as I mentioned, when you're on those live videos, showing your flaws and showing that you're just another human being just like them, it makes you relatable and it makes them drawn into you. And this is one of the keys to attracting more of your dream clients. It's one of the most powerful things that we teach inside the Personal Trainers Elite Academy with something we call trust build marketing videos and so that is the kind of content that you want to be putting on your feed whether this is on facebook or instagram so your profile is primed and so when people come to your page they see what you're about they see you're an expert and authority as someone they can trust and if they feel they can trust you they're going to feel that they can open up and talk personally with you when it goes into the next stage which is getting into their dms right it goes down in the dms you might have heard that before it really does go down in the DMs, but it goes down in the DMs in a different way to the dating world, right? We're talking about prospecting in a proactive way with these people in their private messenger. Crazy, right? Who would have ever thought that you're gonna have conversations with strangers on the internet 
but actually now talk about their goals and their personal struggles. And this is really where the magic happens. Believe it or not, it's not just about the posting, it's about what happens behind the scenes, what you don't see. And so when you do start these interactive conversations, either through those Facebook groups or from your profile, you really wanna ask a few things and make sure that you are leading the conversation. Okay, this is the key in enrolling more clients is you lead that conversation and you're the one who asks the questions, right? So, so you're diagnosing their problems. And so you want to ask questions around their goals, right? What are their desires? What do they want to achieve? You want to find out about their current situation, what's going on in their life right now, how are they feeling, where are they at in relation to that goal, what are the current roadblocks? Okay, you want to try and avoid saying things like, what's your struggle right now? What are you finding hardest? A lot of people don't like to admit they're finding things hard or, or their struggles. So we prefer to use softer language and we go deeper into that inside the academy, but finding out about their current roadblocks the things that are holding them up from getting to where they wanna be is the key. And the goal of this entire conversation is to identify a gap, a gap from where their current state is to where they would like to be so that you can identify there is an opportunity for you to come in and help them on that journey. So once you've identified the gap, that's when you wanna offer them a free call. Okay, that's it. You just wanna offer them a free call. There's no strings. You just wanna lightly open up the communication channel to say, hey, I think I might be able to share some insights or some advice that might possibly be able to help you. Would you like to hop on a call and have a chat? And that's what's gonna lead into your sales process to actually sign them up. So that's it. That's really as simple as it needs to be. Taking people from a leadership post, a vulnerable post where you open up into those private conversations in Messenger and DMs, opening up, finding out about their current situation, leading that conversation, and then offering a call. And in the final part of this organic marketing masterclass series, I'm gonna be sharing with you how to actually conduct your call, your consultation to take them from that next stage on to a call to, to become a client. But in the next episode of this series, we're gonna be diving into leadership and community, how to build your own community so you can take these people from other places all over social media. You can become the leader, you can become the group owner who's going to lead these people on their journey, add more value to them because not everybody is going to buy the first touch point you connect with them, some take longer. And so we wanna be prepared and have strategies in place so we can warm those people up further, bring them into our world, show them what we're about, and then eventually sign them up. So stay tuned for the next episode. And if you enjoyed this training, give it a thumbs up, like this video. And if you have any comments, drop a question or comment below this video. We'd love to hear what your thoughts are. And if you've already tried this and maybe um, the results that you've had so far, and remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Lee Constant to me, Personal Trainers Week, for more training videos just like this. And I'll see you in the next episode.